yeah, members. It is now official that the interest charged to students by HELB is illegal. This is after High Court Judge Alfred Mabea issued an order. In the case presented before him against the Higher Education Loans Board, HELB, Anne Mugure, Davis Ngudu, and Wangui Washira argued that the interest rates and penalties are high and violates their social and economic rights as stipulated in the Constitution of Kenya. Like many Kenyans who have benefited from the loan and defaulted have for the longest time been gagged during employment. In the case number E002 of the 2021 dated 23rd March of 2021, it was found out that Mr. Mugure, who is a young person living with disability, borrowed 82980000 in July 2004 at 2% interest and by July 2016, the debt had accumulated to 540,464 shillings. Nguthu borrowed 146 and 90 shillings in July 2016 which amounted to 335,207 by March 2021. Ms. Washira borrowed 135,000 in July 2016, which has so far increased to 336,573 shillings. By February 2021, Ruth Mulwa is one of those who have benefited from loan from HELP. I'm a beneficiary of uh, uh, HELP since 2010. I started taking HELP loan when I was doing my undergraduate. And from that time, I've been uh, repaying my, my help continuously. Uh, to this level, I'm, I'm still paying, but now on a, on a higher level. I cleared my undergraduate. I also did my postgraduate, that is master's. And currently, I'm, uh, I'm repaying my help loan for my certification course. And Benson claims that many young people in the country are unemployed, even though they have help loans. Uh, youths huko nje hawana kazi sure ama unapata umefanya kazi unapata pesa mingi alafu inakuwa used or sometimes you get some little money and now you also in, again back to debts eh pesa ikikuja tena you pay your debts so hakuna kazi consistent so ni muhimu tu kupata ku, mtu kuanza from a pay slip hapo ndipo naona ikiwa mzuri kuanza kulipa help uh, go, uh, bearing, the fa uh, bearing in mind that uh, there's a lot of uh, unemployment in our, in our country, yes. so they are supposed to consider that. Anyone who has not gotten unemployment, they are not supposed to be uh, deducted any money or uh, uh, levies uh, put on their loans whatsoever. What percentage uh, do they deduct from your, your help loan? Uh, I believe currently it's 2%, but initially it used to be 1% per month. The latest figures from HELP show that outstanding loan accounts are currently at 94,216 from 109,661 recorded as of February this year, with outstanding loans reaching to 10.2 billion shillings. I think on my take, you're supposed to... Uh, measure and see if a person can actually pay. If you're not able to pay and your source of income, let's say if, if it's 15,000, actually by clearing off that debt and one like where to end the to I think it's more of going to be of more benefit than Kwanza Kulipa. And then Sasa Kuimposia are to interest. So why would you do that in the first place? It's not a bank. You're not trying to get money from people. You want to help students. Mm. And by you wanting to help students, don't insist I'm a start pressuring people to start paying with interest. If you want to start uh, your own business, don't start depriving people of their own income from their own pockets. Right now, people are struggling. So, so can be a help na interest. Surely, it doesn't make any sense. We are here to help out people. So as the government, you should also look into that issue na mwache kwekia watu interests. For Ebru TV, I'm Ode Francis.